Welcome to this tutorial about 4D Interactive Anatomy. In this video I will show you how to use this platform for teaching and learning anatomy online. 4D Interactive Anatomy is an online dissection lab. It uses interactive models of real cadavers that were scanned throughout the dissection process. The platform is browser-based, so you do not need to download and install any software. You can use your own laptop or any other device to access the interactive modules. To access the contents, you will need a user account. To sign up for a free trial, go to 4danatomy.com and click on free trial. Once you complete the registration, you will receive an email from Pat Freeman. You will need to click the link in the email to finalize your registration. I recommend that you register an account now and follow along this video to make the most of it. Once you have a user account, you can go to login and sign in to access the interactive modules from anywhere. After you log in, select the module you would like to explore. You may need to scroll down to find every module. Dentistry students may find a skull-based module useful, while general medicine students may appreciate the dissection modules more. Let's select one. The modules work similarly to Google Earth. You can tilt, rotate and zoom in on the specimen. Thanks to our unique scanner technology, you can also dissect the specimen layer by layer, as many times you want. To change layers, use the navigation buttons on the bottom left part of the image viewer, or use Shift plus Scroll. To superimpose layers or structures, you can use the layer blending feature. You can find this feature in the bottom right part of the image viewer within the branch icon. Navigate to the layer you want to blend. Click the layer blending box and navigate to another layer. Use the blending opacity slider to adjust the blending rate. Each module has four tabs. The structures tab allows you to search for structures within the module. To restrict search results to the layer you are currently viewing, check the box Filter by Layer. Click Solid to locate the structure. Each structure on 4D Interactive Anatomy has a unique URL link that you can copy and paste into emails, lectures, ID lists, or other course materials. For example, if you want your students to review the AR-12, you can go to the Structures tab, find the image that you would like to use, let's pick this one. As you can see, the URL address in my browser has changed and now I can copy this and paste it into my materials. For example, I can open a new email and paste the link and send it to my students. This is especially useful if you want to instruct your students to review a structure in particular. When you open a 4D interactive anatomy link, you will be directed to the structure automatically. You might need to log in first in order to view the structure. If you are a subscriber of 4D interactive anatomy, you can export any of our 1.5 million plus high resolution images. You can use the images to illustrate your lectures, publications and research materials. You can find the image export button next to the layer navigation buttons. To export an image, you just need to click the export image button and it will download in a JPEG format in a second. You can drag and drop the image into your materials and ready to go. The watermark is automatically added. For example, you can create a detailed dissection guide that your students can follow step by step on the platform. On the Labels tab you can select Preset Views and identify the structures on the image. 
to highlight structures, click on their names. You can also point your cursor at the image to identify the different structures. You can also simulate the dissection process by going to the Labels tab. Navigate to the outermost layer of the specimen. Starting with this layer, work your way through each view you can select on the left side and study the structures. Once you are finished with the layer, go to the next layer and repeat the process. On the quiz tab, you can test your knowledge about the structures within the module. To create a new quiz, you need to go to the quiz tab and click the wheel icon, then select create new quiz. You will need to name your quiz and hit create. You can add questions to your new quiz from the question bank or you can create new questions. To create a new question, first go to the Structures tab, find the structure you want your students to identify, then go back to the Quiz tab, select the gear icon, select Create new question, Change the question type to identify structure and the system automatically populates the right answer as well as three wrong answers. You can edit the answers if you want to. Once you are ready, quick save. You can add your new question to your quiz by checking the box and hitting save. As you can see, it takes just a few seconds to create a new quiz question. Therefore, you can easily create a 20 question quiz in just a few minutes. If you want to run an exam, you can hide your quiz until you want to start it. You can also check in allow running quiz only once, so your students cannot repeat the test. Once you are done adding questions, refresh your browser, select your quiz, copy its URL, and send it to your students. Once the test is over, you can find and download the quiz results under the wheel icon. On the Info tab, you will find some general information about the structures within the module. If you are a student, we recommend that you use 4D Interactive Anatomy side by side your course notes and other materials. While you are learning about the structures and their functions, you can locate them on the platform and see what they look like in real life in situ. You can use Google Meets to live stream your videos.
or you can use OBS to record or live stream your videos as well. You can use any other software you would like to use to capture your screen and record a video, but these are free tools and are easy to use. You can subscribe to 4D Interactive Anatomy as an individual if you would like to use it for studying anatomy or illustrating your research and publications. Please use the subscribe menu on our website to do so. If you would like to use 4D Interactive Anatomy as an educator, please write us an email at info at 4danatomy.com and let us know the number of students who would need access to the site. I hope you found this video useful. If you have any questions or feedback about the platform, please write us an email at info at 4 Stay safe and have a great day.